guys. Today I'm going to be showing you how to lock a file in your uh, recorder. So let's go ahead and log in. And uh, this is the new interface. Uh, so I'm going to be showing you on the new interface as well as the old interface. So the first thing you want to do is you want to go to video. Now uh, here I have uh, uh, just one camera, but uh, I've already selected four in there. So uh, let's go ahead and click play so you can see there's a camera there. So that's the camera there. Just select this so you can see. Now let me just go ahead and stop this. And then if you notice from the bottom here, you have the uh, little icon. Go ahead and select your file of interest, and then you have your lock. Just go ahead and simply click on that, and then you will get a succeeded, succeeded one. So click OK, and that's basically how you lock your uh, your specified file. And the recorder will retain that until, until you unlock it, basically. So uh, moving on to the old interface, we do the same. Go to the uh, footage. Uh, here I have an, an IP camera. This is an NVR. Put in stop the video. Uh, do the same. Go into the bottom there and select. Now, if you only have uh, uh, one file here, it's not going to allow you to do the lock. Uh, let me show you how that's done. You can click on lock. So you cannot lock writing file because it's still being written. So, but um, if you wait uh, another hour, so give me one second. All right, one hour has passed, and let's go ahead and go to search. Right, let's go to the first camera. Show you that we have footage. All right, we can stop this. Then let's click on that icon in the bottom there. So now we have two hours. I'm going to select the first one. Go ahead and lock it. Now in this version, because this is the old one, it's not going to show you anything. Uh, you can't fi uh, lock a file that's already locked, basically. So let's go ahead and try the other one. The other one's still being overwritten, so you can't lock it. But there is a little button on the right hand side here, and you can see, and this is the same thing for the other one. You can see that you can unlock it here. I'm going to click on lock. That'll remove it from the uh, locked files. And you can lock the, uh, the new one. So let's go ahead and do that. See the new one's locked. And that's basically how you would uh, lock files with uh, LP quarters. Thank you for watching.